In this video, we'll reveal the art of understanding your man and special emphasis is taken to ensuring you get to understand the man when he goes quiet. Remember to watch to the end as I'll give you the secret to what you need to do when your man goes quiet. Welcome to a channel that is always new and provides fresh, authentic wisdom that is educative, informative, entertaining, and critical. My name is Dr. Stephen Biko. I am a unique and endearing young man. In this channel, I post authentic relationship advice, unapologetic stories of adulthood, traveling, and crazy bumble dates. If you're new or haven't joined the community, hit the subscribe button and let's win together. Women have a lot to learn about men before their relationship can be really fulfilling. They need to learn that when a man is upset or stressed, he will automatically stop talking and go quiet to work things out. As a woman, you need to learn that a man requires this space and not even his best friend is allowed to evade it. So a woman should not be so scared that you have done something terribly wrong. You need to learn if you just let your man go through this phase. After a while, he will start talking and all will be well. This lesson is difficult for a woman because in a woman's world, one of the golden rules was never to abandon a friend when she was upset. It just doesn't seem loving, loving to abandon your man when he is upset. Because she cares for him, a woman wants to come to a man's space or mind to offer him help. In addition, she often mistakenly assumes that if she could ask him lots of questions about how he is feeling and be a good listener, then he will feel better. This only accepts men more. A woman instinctively wants to support him the way she will want to be supported. Your intentions as a woman are good, but the outcomes are counterproductive. Both men and women need to stop offering methods of caring they will prefer and start learning different ways their partners think, feel, and react. As promised, let's look at why men go quiet. Men do go quiet for a variety of reasons. When a man needs to think about the problem and find a practical solution to a problem. Secondly, he doesn't have an answer to a question or a problem. Men were never taught to say, gee, I don't have an answer. I need to think and find one. Other men assume he's doing just that and he becomes quiet. Third thing, a man will go quiet. He has become upset or stressed. And at such times, he needs to be alone to cool off and find his control again. He doesn't want to do or say something he might regret. The fourth reason becomes very important when, a ma when men are in love. At times, they begin to lose and forget themselves. A man can tell too much intimacy robs him of his power. A man will need to regulate how, how close they get. Whenever they get too close so as to lose themselves, alarm bells go off and they become quiet. As a result, they are rejuvenated and find their loving and their powerful self again. At this point, I just want to point out some of the reasons why do women talk. Women talk for a variety of reasons. Sometimes they talk for the same reasons that men stop talking. Some common reasons why women will talk will include to convey and gather information. This is generally the only reason men talk. A man stops talking to figure out what he wants to say. A woman talks to think out loud. A third reason, a woman will talk to feel better and more, are more centered when she is upset. A, a third reason is to feel better and more centered when she is upset. A man stops talking when he is upset. In being quiet, he has a chance to cool off. A, th a fourth reason a woman will talk is to create intimacy. Through sharing her inner feelings, she is able to know her loving self. A man stops talking to find himself again. Too much intimacy, he fears will rob him of himself. Without this critical understanding of our differences and needs, it is easy to see why couples struggle so much in relationships. Why should you not press a man to talk when they are quiet? It is important for a woman to understand, not to try to get a man to talk before he is ready. While discussing this topic in one of my clients' group sessions, one of my clients shared that, in a tribe, 
Mothers will instruct young women getting married to remember that when a man is upset and stressed, he will withdraw and get quiet. She was not to take it personally. Because it will happen from time to time, it does not mean that he did not love her. They assured her that he will come back to himself. But most important, they warned the young, the young women never to insist on getting the man to communicate as he was doing before. I would risk on getting him irritated and end up hurting her feelings or persona. Much unnecessary conflict has resulted from a woman going against this wisdom. Women just haven't understood that men really do need to be alone or silent when they are upset. When a man goes quiet, a woman just doesn't understand what is happening. She naturally tries to get him to talk. If there is a problem, she hopes to nurture him by drawing him to talk about it. She asks, is there something wrong? When the man says no, but she can feel he is upset. She wonders why is he withholding his feelings. Instead of letting him work out his, inside his mind, she unknowingly interrupts his internal process. She asks again, I know something is bothering you. What is it? When he says, it's nothing. She asks, it's not nothing. Something is bothering you. What are you feeling? And the man will lash out. Look, I am fine. Now leave me alone. And the drama starts. She says, how can you treat me like this? You never talk to me anymore. How am I supposed to know what you are feeling? You don't love me. I feel so rejected by you. At this point, a man will lose control and begin saying things that he will regret later. At this point, a man loses control and begins saying things that he will regret later. His defenses go up and he begins to lash out at her. Question of the day. Share some scenarios where partners misunderstand each other and cause friction in, a, in your relationship. Share some scenarios where partners misunderstand each other and causes friction in a relationship. Give your comments in the comment sections and I'd like to connect with you and others from our community will do so in our comment section. We've covered in this video understanding and interpreting a man and what to do in a relationship. On our next video, we will cover the common warning signals to watch out when men do talk. If you haven't subscribed, definitely subscribe for more videos like this. Don't miss out on being part of a community of winners. And if you have any ideas on future information or videos you'd like to see, kindly let me know in the comment section. Until next time, go out there and keep winning. See you on our next video.